When the legendary Italian writer Umberto Eco died in 2016 at the age of 84, he left behind an immense collection of books. Though not infinite like the library of all possible books, Eco's private home library is quite large, especially when the camera follows him passing shelf after packed shelf. Best known around the world for his novels The Name of the Rose and Foucault's Pendulum, the man not only wrote a lot but he also read a lot. And quite recently the Italian state acquired Umberto Eco's library and archive. His modern library comprising around 30,000 volumes will be kept in a wing of the University Library of Bologna, where he taught for most of his life. While his ancient books, counting around 1,200 volumes, will be kept by the National Library in Milan. 